morning, 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 five minute meditators. I hope that you are waking up this morning, the first day of February, 2023, filled with gratitude and grace, thanking God for another day, appreciation for another opportunity to be your absolute best self. I hope that you are ready after experiencing a, a beautiful journey through January of intentional freedom to really begin to let things go. That's what this entire month is going to be about. I know it's the month that we celebrate Valentine's Day. I think love should be celebrated every day. I, I you know, um, don't really subscribe to Valentine's Day because I think we need to show that level of love to our significant others every day. So let's get it. Let's go. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. It's a few more seconds. Holding that breath in. And release. I am ready to let it go. I am ready to let it go. What are you ready to let go? What's holding you back? What are those barriers? What are those fears? What are those concerns, right? That you continue to allow you to not reach your destiny, your purpose. What about your past are you holding on to so tightly that you can't breathe? You can't move to your next level. You can't experience love. You can't experience freedom. This month, we're letting it all go. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. I am bigger than my barriers. I am bigger than my barriers. That means that you're willing to rise above what your barriers are trying to do to hold you back. Don't allow yourself to be a self-sabotaging anchor in your life. Don't hold yourself back because of fears. Allow fear to motivate you to push through all of those things. Allow fear to be the guider for you that allows you to just move and achieve your goals. Yeah. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds. Holding that breath in. And release. I give myself permission to move forward and let go. I give myself permission to move forward and let go. It has to begin with you. You have to decide that those things that have been holding you back, those situations, circumstances, things like that, cannot, can no longer hold you down. It can no longer stop you from being your great self. We've all had some kind of event that happened in our life that we hold on to that brought disappointment and pain. You have to decide to let it go. Ready? One, two, three. Deep breath in. And hold. Hold. Hold that breath. Just a few more seconds holding that breath in. And release. I celebrate letting go. Anything that no longer serves me. I celebrate letting go anything that no longer serves me. That means that you may have to let go of people and situations and circumstances that no longer help build you up and no longer serve you. And I know that that can be scary because the fear is if I let these people go, who will I have? If I let the situation go, who will I have? You get to have you. You get to support you and be your number one priority. And then 
in your healing of letting go, you're going to actually begin to attract the people that are supposed to be in your life that's not coming in to hurt you or to take advantage of you or to manipulate you. When you let go of those past barriers, those past hurts and disappointment, you give yourself permission to be revived and renewed and restored. I see you. Namaste.